In this video, we're going to go through how to deploy a um, custom component onto Publish, and then how to um, configure it and author, and then um, deploy the changes onto the Publish system. So let's take a look at our custom um, component. So we'll go to Sites, and we're going to go to My HTL 64, 6.4, of course. Open up the page. And here we can see our component. So we'll put it into edit mode. Click the wrench icon, and then we have um, text field, text area. So we'll make a change. This is updated text. Now, of course, if we want to get this page onto the um, publish instance, we have to make sure that we deploy the entire package, including the code and everything um, along with it. So to do that, we're going to take this package and deploy it to the publish instance. So here's where the trick is to deploy everything you need to um, get onto the publish instance in order for your page with a custom component to work. So what we want to do, we're looking at, notice it's 4502. This is our author instance. We'll switch it to 4503. We'll sign in with admin admin. Now we're looking at the package manager on our production system. So we're going to upload our package that contains our custom component. And then install it. Now we've got everything that we need onto our publisher instance in order to replicate that page on author into publish and then have the changes show up. So let's see that work. So now we're back on to our um, author instance. We're going to take a look at our page. So we can see that it contains, this is the updated text, so this is exactly what we want to replicate. So we'll go back to, um, to our author. We can see it's 4502. We'll click Quick Publish. So now we've um, replicated this. And then because we've installed the package on the publisher instance, it has all of the code, including the um, HGL component that has the WC use POJO class on, as part of it. So if um, we take a look now, we go back to here, we'll go back to 4502, we'll switch to 4503, and of course there's no edit, so we gotta get rid of that. So it's now 453 under content, my HGL 64 EN English, so we'll render that. Let's take a look. So we can see that now we've got, this is an updated text, this shows this is running on the publisher instance. This means that everything is working as it should be. The uh, code is deployed as part of the package. The backend Java class is deployed. It's in active state, so everything is there. So this is really what you need to do to, or in order to run a um, custom component on the publish instance. You have to deploy the package. It contains all of the code, all of the Java, all of the class libraries, so forth. Make sure it's on your publisher instance, and then when you replicate from author to publish, it'll work as shown in this video. Thank you for watching.